Hello children, today we shall learn about safety at home. In our previous video, we learned why our parents become worried if we are late from school and also how to return home safely. What do you do once you get back home safely? Aman comes back home and puts down his bag. He takes some rest and goes to the bathroom to wash his face. Ta -da! His mother rushes to bathroom and finds that Aman has slipped on the wet floor. I know this might have happened to any one of us, right kids? Aman's mother often asks him, How did you get hurt this time? Sometimes he says, Sister left her toy car on the floor. I tripped over it. Sometimes he says, I was trying to reach the pickle jar and fell from the chair. Amman is little careless at home. And whenever he says, What can go wrong? I am at home. Something does go wrong. So what can be done? We can keep our room clean and put things at their right place after the use, like toys in the toy box, so that we don't trip or stumble over things. We should be careful while walking on the wet floor, like the bathroom floor. But still, most of the accidents occur at home. In few of them, we can get hurt badly. Like many kids fall down as they run while going up or coming down through stairs. Few kids get hurt badly this way, so don't do this mistake. Sometimes kids get cuts while trying to cut something with knife, blade or scissors. So don't play with sharp things. Use small scissors if you need to cut paper or to do some craft work and that too under adult supervision. Few kids forget everything when their favorite cartoon is coming on the TV. In hurry, they touch the switchboard to turn on TV with wet hand. You can get electric shock if you touch switchboard or any appliance with wet hand. So never touch electric wires to avoid the electric shocks. When you get the smell of your favorite dish from the kitchen, it is very hard to resist. I know. And you rush to kitchen and try to find out if it is ready or not. You become restless and might touch a hot utensil this way and burn your finger. And remember, your mother does lots of work in the kitchen and stays very busy. If you disturb her, she might get puzzled and touch something hot accidentally. You don't want that your mother get hurt while cooking tasty food for you, right children? Your mother cooks your favorite dish specially for you and she gives you once it is ready. So be patient and wait for that tasty dish to get ready. You should stay away from fire like burning oven, gas stove, etc. The fire may look attractive, but it is very dangerous. Few children play with matchboxes or candles. But remember, big fires which burns a whole house starts from a very small fire. So don't play with matchboxes or candles. Light crackers outside home in presence of an adult. Crackers are for celebration, not for burning your hand or your home. Isn't it children? So be careful with crackers and wear cotton dress when lighting crackers. Remember again, fire is a very dangerous thing. So be little alert and avoid accidents at home. Stay away from fire and electric wires. Don't play with sharp things like knife and don't run when going up or coming down using stairs. 
we don't want accidents at home because it is our home sweet home so stay safe and enjoy your home that is all for now kids bye bye